Hello everyone, my name is Lita Carbone. I'm the Instructional Support Specialist for the College of St. Rose. And today I'm going to show you how you can adjust your meeting settings for your Zoom recordings. Some of our professors have asked if you can have students keep their videos on and still be able to see them, but not have their videos show up in your Zoom recordings for privacy reasons. Um, unfortunately with Zoom, this is not an option, but what I can do is I can show you some different tips and tricks that will adjust your recordings so you can keep your students' um, privacy private. So as you'll see here, I have a participant in my meeting. So I'm going to pin my video. So this is the main video that everyone is seeing. And then I'm going to share my screen. Let's see, go back to the beginning. Okay. Okay, so right now I have my video up here at the top, but if I keep this open, this will also come up in my Zoom recording. So if I didn't want that to happen, or if I had all of my participants showing up on the side here, then what I can do is I can go to the more option, select hide video panel, and then that way the participants won't come up in my Zoom recording. What happens is if I keep my video panel up, if I try to move it to another screen, it is still going to come up in my Zoom recording on the right hand side here. So if you wanna keep your students hidden, um, you can hide the video panel. To make sure that your students are staying in the meeting, you can click on the participants tab and it will show you the number of students that are in your meeting. So you can also, if you want, okay. If you want your students to continue participating or have the opportunity to ask questions, you can have them say, this is so-and-so, can I ask a question about this? Or you can have them use the raise hand feature. And that will help keep them engaged as well. Okay, so let's say I stop sharing my screen and I'm finished with my lecture. So I'm going to hit stop recording. Okay, then I'm going to end my meeting. And you'll notice that it's converting to a file. And it normally takes a little bit of time. <laughs> Okay, so then it will open up in a folder here. Hello everyone, my name is Lita Carbone. I am the instructional support. I'm gonna go ahead and mute so you guys don't have to hear this twice. All right, so then if we get into the actual meeting, you'll see that you can see the video panel up here. So if I were to keep it in gallery view throughout the whole time, then it would look like this on the side. So if you want to keep your students video hidden, you do have to use the hide video panel.